Girls Hoops Lake District Springfield hosting Ashland. Early action, Blue Devils get off to the fast start. Pass over to Kamora Carruthers, hits the jumper. Springfield with the early lead. More from the Blue Devils, Janessa Green kicks out to Gretchen Sigmund. Freshman showing off the range. Springfield with their foot on the gas pedal all night long. Mia Rose, nothing but nylon on the triple. Ashland would start the third on a 13-0 run, but it would not be enough. Blue Devils shut the door down the stretch. They will face Perrysburg in the sectional finals after the 20-point win. Well, I think we got to stay consistent. We got to play with a lot of energy. Um, we got to come out and fight. And the first time we play, we got to keep them off the glass. They they really hit the glass hard. Straight fellow, she's a really good player. Griggs is a good player. Uh, Volant, she's a good player. They all hit the glass really hard. I uh, just play our basketball game and worry about how well we do and just continue to, uh, to, to fight and be aggressive on both ends of the floor. With more from the Blue Devils floor, we turn to Greg Frankie. Springfield had to beat Ashland to get another shot at Perrysburg. They played a good game against them in the NLL tournament, just fell short in the fourth quarter. Coach Cliff Hodges says he was a little bit concerned about the game because Springfield came in as the favorite, and these are the kind of games sometimes you can get caught looking ahead. It did not look like it was going to be a problem as it was a 21-point game at halftime, but then a 13-0 run by Ashland to start the third quarter really had the situation tightening up a lot. In fact, it was down to just a single-digit lead, but Kamora Carruthers hit a couple of really big three-point shots. Mia Rose made a couple of great penetrations to the basket to finish it off, and before you knew it, that eight-point lead was back up to 16, and it ended up 20, 53-33 the final score, setting up Springfield to play Perrysburg in what should be a very interesting game in the next round of the sectionals.